Teachers at Anacostia High School in Southeast DC walked out this morning furious that all of the bathrooms were broken, all of them. The city had rushed to fix a plumbing problem overnight, but in the meantime, staffers had been asked to walk three blocks to use the bathroom at a middle school. Bruce Lashad reports these teachers feel disrespected. Scores of teachers walked out of the building, lining up at the front door and demanding better treatment. So our goal is to stay here for the next hour until the chancellor's office come and hear what we got to say. One teacher, an Anacostia resident, complained on Twitter about disrespect of teachers here and everywhere. Yesterday, gunshots outside. Today, they tell us we have to walk three blocks to use bathrooms. Enough is enough. We are going to stand together. What's strange is that the city just finished a $63 million renovation at Anacostia. But the water went out last night, and workers say they had to wait until 6 a.m. to get a replacement part. And then a pipe blew. Hey, you got to use the bathroom. Can't focus if you got to use the bathroom. But interim chancellor Amanda Alexander says the toilets were working by the time students arrived at 8 a.m. I'm a little disappointed that some adults um, made the choice to walk out of the building um, and that an hour and a half of valuable instructional time was lost today as a result of that. The chancellor says that she is not aware of any pervasive problems with the infrastructure here at Anacostia High School, but she says she wants to talk to the teachers and find out what their complaints really are. At Anacostia High School in Southeast DC, Bruce Lashan, WUSA 9. A spokesman for the chancellor says none of those teachers will face any discipline for the walkout. He says they are committed to dealing with any of those issues at Anacostia High. This is the